as ends cope as well as they can without the added fear of being infected by the novel coronavirus. But with this new threat, a few Palestinian artists are taking their art to the next level. We draw scary things because the virus is very scary and harmful. We also draw bright and hopeful things on them so that people will like wearing them. They're painting N95 respirator masks to raise awareness about the COVID-19 virus. Israeli officials have announced an increase in the supply of medical equipment, including 600 testing kits and 1,000 masks. And Gazan authorities are working to build 1,000 new isolation rooms. But with only 60 ICU beds available for 2 million people, the director of the UN's mission in Palestine, Matthias Schmal, says it would be an illusion to think an epidemic could be managed in a closed-off space like Gaza. Palestinian officials reported the Strip's first novel coronavirus infections last Sunday and three days later, its first death. It saddens me to announce the first death in Palestine. A woman in her 60s was reported this morning in the village of Bidu. As Gazans struggle to protect themselves from the outbreak, the idea of painted masks is becoming popular. We published our work on social media. People liked the idea a lot, so they started asking us for masks and bring us masks to draw on. As the people of Gaza, brace for yet another humanitarian crisis. Sarah Balter, TRT World.